Yes, all the man I need. All the man I need. And who's that about? <laughs> when he was like, who do you think is by? It's by Bobby. <laughs> I don't know. I don't even know if they were together at that time. But like, <laughs> I can't. I can't. Damn, Whitney. <laughs> It was a look for me. <laughs> it was a look. What's up, GTN fam? Welcome back to GTN. And I'm back with another reaction video. I appreciate y'all. I appreciate y'all so much from the bottom of my heart. Underneath my titty. <laughs> my pecs. For subscribing to my channel. Through all the moments and everything. Like... And I'm posting excessively on my other channels too. My shorts channel, my um, my main channel, I did a how-to video, vlogs. So for this channel to be the most active and to be moving still after so much, that means so much. And I thank y'all for helping me get to 500. I think it's like 502, but I appreciate it. We on the road, posting weekly, doing our thing. I love y'all and I thank y'all so much. And with all that being said, I cannot wait to start this video because I love Miss Whitney Houston. And the title of this video is called Whitney Houston Shade and Diva Moments. We gonna play the video. Miss Whitney Houston. You tell us whatever it is you want us to know. Pull the hair back. She got to pull the hair back. She's like, let me let y'all know. I got to let y'all know. I think I seen this Waiting to Exhale interview. Yeah, that's my movie too. Y'all like that movie? I love that movie. Well, let's put it like this. We're here to talk about Exhale. My life is none of your business. Hey. Girl, the shade, the shade. <laughs> that was shade. <laughs> Leave it to Whitney, boy. Whitney... I didn't look when I was a little kid and I first like watched the Whitney Houston movie. It was, I think, The Preacher's Wife. I thought that was the real Whitney Houston. I thought that was who she was until like YouTube came out, you know, internet, social media, and I found videos of her being like shady. I'm like, this ain't no first lady. This lady is savage. Play video. <laughs> Ooh, pop land, pop land. I like this channel. Britney Spears is doing uh, my prerogative. I heard she's remixed right now. She's doing the video, doing my prerogative. What are the chances that you? And uh, Bobby do, oops, I did it again. No chance. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. Sometimes. Not always. No. Sometimes. That means sometimes. <laughs> Y'all seen that shade, Whitney, like, sometimes, motherfucker. <laughs> Hey, low key, I be having my Whitney Whitney Houston moments too. When people ask me dumb questions, they know I hate when people ask me dumb questions. You already know the answer to, and I just I play dumb. I be like, mm, 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 mm. <laughs> play the video. Answering for you, like to hear this it's fabulous voice a little bit. I seen this on Instagram. I seen it. I seen it. Can you do a, a little of it? Anything? Yeah. <laughs> 
Did you really know? Did you really know? Wait. <laughs> Wait, it was like, I don't care. She played him. Oh, God. And it, it mainly been the interviewers. Like, she don't like this. Whitney hated it. It seemed like Whitney was fed up with these interviews. Like every time she would be interviewed, she would be saying slick ass shit. And I love it. I love it. I love it. It's the way she do it. Like, it ain't like a, she ain't cursing you out, but she cursing you out though. Like, it's, it's, it's just shady. I love it. R.I.P. Whitney. No, you know. Thank you. Is the new uh -uh. single? Yes, it is. Yeah, all the man I need. All the man I need. And who's that about? Oh. I'm just asking the question. <laughs> Whitney. <laughs> Whitney was like, who you think it's about? It's about Bobby. <laughs> I don't even know I don't even know if they were together at that time, but like <laughs> I can't. I can't. Damn, Whitney. <laughs> it was a look for me. <laughs> it was a look. Did, yeah. did, did Bobby know you were doing that interview? Uh, no. Does he know now? Uh, no. No? No. But I'm sure I'll be getting a call. Yeah. Are you worried about that call? And it was like, bitch, I'm grown. <laughs> and that was when they were, I think they were divorced. Yeah, she was trying to come back. Well, she did come back with her um her last album. Um, I think it was Million Dollar Bill. No. Oh, the last album. Yeah. Or was it one of them? A million something. I forgot. Y'all, I'm tripping. I said a million dollar bill. What y'all gonna kill me in the comments? Well, her last album was "I Look to You." Yes, I was researching it. I haven't played that album in so long. That album was "I Look to You." Yes, and also "Million Dollar Bill" was one of the singles off that album. I remember now. I would always play it, but I was like, okay, what is it? Million dollar? Not no. I Look To You was a single, and it was the name of the album, the last album, and <laughs> Million Dollar Bill. Yeah. Play the video. Get my facts, my receipts. Not my receipts. In the words of Whitney, had to get, show me the receipts. A An angel in her throat. There are some extremely gifted and talented young women and young men out there who don't have to really put on Halloween costumes. Were you buddies with Whitney? I was. You were? Mm -hmm. What's your favorite memory of her? She was Johnny Versace's favorite artist. And he wanted her to sing at his memorial. And as she sung a cappella, she first of all, she got in the order said, I heard I was Johnny's favorite singer, but I'd never met him. And she winked at Madonna. <laughs> then... Wait, she couldn't lip sync, not on this show, but she couldn't lip sync. <laughs> I can't let it happen. No, there will be no Millie Vanilli in here. Ooh. In this building. There's a lot of Millie Vanilli down here. Uh -huh. um, changed it for the air. They did it for me and a few other people. Other people, too. <laughs> other people, yes. <clears throat> Can I ask how much you weigh now? Sure. How much do you weigh now? I ain't telling you. <laughs> I think I just got sucker punched. You did. <laughs> And that's what I'm talking about. Like it's it's the way Whitney do it. Like <laughs> it's the way she do it. <laughs> Love it. She a classic queen. 
Love it. She is the queen. Going through all that stuff with the whole world watching on. I don't include them. They include themselves. We had uh, Maya Carey here in the studio. You did? How is she doing? Well, uh, she was doing great. Oh, great. Yes. It's great. What I'm curious about, what do you think of her? What do I think of her? Yes. I don't think of her. I... <laughs> God, you can't. Oh God, Whitney, Whitney. <laughs> I don't think of her. Don't think of her. Musically, what do I think of her? Yes. I think she's a good singer. Right. You know, people say you can sing. I say, you know, they right. <laughs> hey. Um, there are times when I get uh, kind of uh, tired of of, uh, um, of being in this position. Um, I'd like to pass off to somebody else. I'd like to say, you know, I wish I had to double sometimes saying, you know, will you do this job for me? Will you go and to this meeting? Will you make this decision for me? You know. When do you, when do you specifically get this feeling? I mean, you, you talked about this thing. <coughs> don't want to be with the Houston or just... There is no specific time, honey. It just happens at certain times. I mean, mm. I can say on October the 29th, I felt this way. It's just at certain times, you know, it's, it's, uh, it varies. And then it also interviewers ask dumb questions. I will be the same way. Like if you keep asking me retarded questions after a while, I'm going to give you what, <laughs> what Whitney given. I'm going to give you Whitney. <laughs> I'm going to be like, bitch, what? <laughs> That's going to be me just like to ask her why she stays with him why doesn't she just leave him i like to ask her why she stays with her man i like to know how her utopia is then we can talk britney spears was passing through australia recently copped a lot of criticism for lip syncing what do you reckon about all of that now you know i don't lip sync that is the right answer with the Houston. <laughs> I think that if you're if you're coming to see a, a somebody who does that and who entertains that way, then that's what you like. You know what I'm saying? If you're coming to see someone who sings and who sings live and who's like, you know, like the Robert Streisands or the the Houston's, then you come see me. During a tense interview, Whitney Houston is asked about still being the princess of R&B. Ooh. Mm. I, I think I've gone beyond the queen of R&B status. I think I've gone beyond the queen of R&B status. I think I've gone beyond the queen of R&B status. I have crossed many a chart and it's gone past the R&B uh, je suis passée par beaucoup de choses. C'est vrai que j'ai chanté dans des, j'ai chanté dans des pubs, j'ai chanté dans des églises, j'ai chanté du gospel. Et c'est vrai que je suis une chanteuse de R&B. C'est vrai que j'ai dépassé ce stade. J'étais beaucoup plus loin. J'ai dépassé les frontières. Et ça va bien au-dessus de R&B. Alors, après la sortie de cette album, um, I don't really know what it's about, but I think that I've got a lot of flack, you know, uh, about I sing too white or I sing, you know, I sing white or something like that. Mm. So I think that maybe that's where it comes from. I don't know. You know, I, I haven't had the time to ask why I get booed at the Soul Train Awards, but I grew up on Soul Train just like every other black kid. See, I didn't know she got. Uh, I didn't know she got booed at the Soul Train. Like that's crazy. They they booed her for not being quote unquote black enough. Ooh, wow. I know they feel stupid now. I'm not exactly sure what singing white is, but I don't think I don't know, there is more soul maybe. to be offered than what you really get. He really loves me. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> right. Did y'all get the capacity of shade in that? She's talking about black women in general. Yeah. 
Did y'all get that? Let's rewind that. Hold up. I don't think y'all got it. Hold up. Because <laughs> I got it. Oh, that was great. I needed that. That just made my my day. That just made my day, my night. Y'all, it's like, what time is it? <sighs> Three in the morning, and I'm up grinding my usual. But that was everything. I love you, Whitney. <laughs> May you rest in the heavenly paradise. Y'all, send me some more request videos like this. I personally picked this out because it just popped up on my feed. And I'm like, ooh, Whitney Shade and Diva Moments? Hell yeah. So GTN fam, if y'all enjoy this reaction video, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. If you have request videos, hashtag GTN fam. Don't forget to join my Patreon, OnlyFans, join my TikTok, join me everywhere. I am everywhere. <laughs> I do everything. My Instagram snap i have all my links down below a lot of things are in gtn forever as a whole but my patreon is that underscore in the middle and my only fans has an underscore at the very end of gtn forever so i love y'all gtn fam and to the next video bye y'all